Hello everyone, it's Mal, and today we're going to be opening and reviewing and looking at and all that jazz, the American Girl Truly Me Jenny's Ice Cream Truck. I am so excited for this video, you guys have no idea, it's going to be so much fun, so I feel like without further ado, since it's going to be so much fun, and because I feel like it's going to be such a long video, let's get started. Hopefully, it comes out nice and easy. And it's, it's, you know, an easy opening. Oh my goodness! Look! You can see the front of it! How cute! Okay, I'm gonna put my scissors over here in Addie's room. We're gonna try to pull, pull it out. Oh, girl! Whew! This may not be as easy as what I thought it would be. Why is it not coming out great? Gosh, if this is another thing like the Willy Wisher house, I'm gonna cry because that did not end well. Yo, I'm bleeding. Okay, update my fingers fine. I doctored it, my mom helped me. So we're good. I'm just a little bit scared now <laughs> opening it because I've never cut myself opening a big accessory set before. So I'm like, oh. So I'm thinking I can just push it out now. Oh yeah, it's coming at the under end. It's coming. We got a delivery. Special delivery. Ice cream's coming with some treats. And it's out! Woo! Here's what it looks like when you get it out of the cardboard box. Like, isn't it cute? Oh my gosh! We have this brown box, which I'm assuming is where all of the good accessories are. It's not too heavy at all but it is it is a pretty good weight though I don't I can't see what I'm doing <laughs> oh. I'm so sorry I just hit y'all okay it doesn't weigh a ton but it is a good weight oh my gosh guys it's so cute oh I love it already Okay, so now we're going to be taking a look at the ice cream truck itself without all the accessories decorating it. So let's talk about the basics. This ice cream truck is a light blue color. You, It has three wheels, two on the back, one on the front. It can roll, so hold on. If I push it to the end of the table and if I give it a light push, it can roll. It's a very light push. I was going to do it harder, but I didn't want it to, like, roll off the table and, like, fall and be traumatic part of the video. It's mostly all plastic. However, the base of it, so, like, underneath it is, like, this wood, okay? But, like, it's, for the most part, pretty much all plastic. So this is the front side of it. The front side, what I'm calling the front, is where you have the window that pops up. I'm calling it a window. It's technically not a window. Okay, it says Jenny's Ice Creams. Okay, and you have a little handle in the middle. So if you open this up, you have a banner that pops up that's rainbow. Like it has stripes on it. It has like a yellow, blue, pink, orange. Uh, the blue is a light blue. It's like red and purple and yeah, lots of colors on it. So this can actually pop up. So it kind of makes that noise. That's how you can tell. Uh, when it's up and it stays there. It's not flimsy where if you put it up it falls back down. It's really really sturdy which I really like that um, detail of that but you want to get it to your appropriate height. I think it's pretty much good right there. Inside on top we're gonna go from top to bottom you have these kind of L shapes uh, pop out. So those is where you put your labels on. Hold on. So these are your labels we're going to talk about these more in a couple of minutes. So these are the labels, okay? These are where you put your favorite of the day's labels, okay? So these just slide up. So you put them on top and you slide them down 
on both sides and they're in, okay? So, yeah, you get four of those, and then kind of separating this top part from the bottom, we have some ice cream graphics. So it's just two ice cream scoops and a cone, okay? And then the bottom is where you put some of your ice cream. So we're gonna talk about the accessories later, but kind of giving you a preview. You get a big, four big tubs of ice cream. So these are what fits in your ice cream. So you have two kind of sections. So the first section, it has um, a cover on it. So the handle is on the left. So you push it open, slides to the right, okay? And then there's these two big circles. And so you put what's in those two circles, your big ice cream tubs, okay? And then you can close the door and voila, keeps your ice cream cool. Same thing on the right. We talked about the first one on the left. On the right, you have that same cover, however, the handle's still on the left. You push it open, however, this slides to the left, and you have your two same big circles where you put your big ice creams, your big ice cream cartons, okay? And then you can close it. And yeah, so that's like the ice cream display kind of thing. Next we have a American Girl sticker, and then we have this white kind of pull-out table. So there's a handle in the middle, you push it out, and voila, and you can put ice cream on it. You can do honestly whatever you want. And then on the bottom right, you have a Jenny's Ice Cream Salted Caramel Ice Cream Carton graphic. You also have a wheel on the side um, to the left. And then to the right on this side, we have our first opening of, of the driving portion of the ice cream cart. Okay, so kind of talking about the driving part of the ice cream truck, we have our seat, which is fabricated, and it has that same pattern of stripes um, as the banner we just talked about. And it's like a really nice cushioned seat, okay? Like your doll's back is not going to hurt sitting on this. Like it's so comfy. It does have a seat belt um, that stretches all the way. It's like a lower lap seat belt, okay? And it's white and it has American Girl embroidered on it. And it is Velcro. It Velcro's in the middle. The bottom part of the seat does lift up. So if you lift it up, kind of going to the closest to the wall, that that's how it lifts up. This is where your battery pack is to put batteries in. So right above the seat we have this hot pink wall and on the wall you have a Jenny's logo that's kind of in rainbow. The floor is has details on it. It's kind of like has like sprinkles that are but they're really thick sprinkles that are like kind of pressed into the floor so if you feel it you can like kind of feel the sprinkles and stuff. And then going to the driving part, you have a steering wheel, which what's really cool about this, if you turn the steering wheel, it actually turns the wheels. The horn can honk. I don't have batteries in this right now, so I apologize. So you can honk the horn. On the left side, you have your radio, so it can play some music. And then you have, so one button plays music, the other button makes an ice cream um, kind of jingle. So people can hear your ice cream truck from far away. They know that ice cream's coming. It also uh, has this like radio's details too with different buttons that you cannot press down. It says FM radio. Really cool. And then on the right side you have your glove box which does not open. You also have your mirrors on the outside. Uh, be careful with the mirrors because I really think the mirrors could break off possibly if you're really rough with it. Um, the, the mirrors are something that you need to be gentle with just like uh, the meal the, not the meals, <laughs> the mirrors um, in Joss's van. Uh, you have to be very gentle with those or else they will fall off. However, these are a lot more sturdier than those, but still be gentle with them because I could see these falling off if you're very rough. Here's kind of the front of the driving thing. So if you're driving down the road and if you look behind you in your car, you would see this. Um, we have, you know, the driving a kind of windshield which it is plastic and it's clear very pretty and then we have a Jenny's sticker ice cream logo uh, this is pretty like printed on it so you can't peel it off it's pretty like it's like printed on and then you have headlights I don't think lights the lights can light up um, however I didn't really look at the batteries I'm not really sure what it all does and then you have just one single wheel uh, underneath this 
This is the other side of the ice cream truck. So on the right on this side, we, no wait, the left, my bad. We have, you know, our driving part. And then to the right, we have some more storage, okay? So on top of this, we have our cabinets, okay? So the left cabinet has a Jenny's logo on it. That's like kind of printed on, but you can like kind of feel it. On the right cabinet, we have the saying yum, yum, yum. And that's kind of like, looks like it can light up, but like it's a sticker, so it can't light up. So opening the left cabinet, we have pretty big storage, honestly. This comes with a lot of places where you can store stuff. So on the door, on the inside, you have two T's. One is higher than the other. So these actually, I'm going to blow your mind. Well, maybe not. You get these kind of display this is kind of like a spoiler alert into the accessories. You kind of get these like display kind of cases. And so on the back of these, they have a T. So to put these in, so this is like a container to keep your bowls. You put the T, you line it up, and then you kind of push it down. You kind of, see, you kind of go on top and then you push it down. And then, so then it stays and stuff and it's really cool I really like how American Girl did that detail it's kind of hard to take it out once you put it in because you know it's made to stay it's not made to fall out okay and then opening the right cabinet you have the same tees because it comes with four different things that you can hang up that have the tee so you have two of those there one's higher than the other and then you have that same big storage compartment just like on the other side you have this pull out table and it's white so you pull it out. I don't think this goes out as far as the other one. I don't know. I have to look at it again. And then you have an American Girl sticker down at the bottom. And then you can really see a wheel on this side, too. Okay, so this is like the back end of the cart. Of the cart of the truck. Excuse me. Um, if you're driving down the road and you look to see what car is in front of you, this is what you would see the back. You know what I mean? So on the back, you have... Some graphics of Jenny's ice cream containers. You have a Jenny's brown butter almond brittle on the top, green mint chip on the bottom, and then you have bumbleberry crisp, which is actually open, and there's a spoon with ice cream leaking out. These are, like, printed on. These are not, like, 3D, so you can't really touch it. You can't really feel it, but they're there. And then on the bottom, we have this drawer. So on the drawer, we have these printed on back in lights and then we have a American Girl logo that's indented and then the top part in the middle you have this handle pulling the door out you can keep storage of ice creams um, or storage of supplies so I'm really glad that they included this because it's another storage compartment and then we have our license plate that says yum and then like I mentioned earlier we have our two back wheels on top of the ice cream truck, on top of the driver's side, you have this horn kind of like siren thing. And this is for like where it plays, you know, your little ice cream jingle to tell people that you're coming. And then it's just like flat. There's like, the driver's side is kind of taller than like the like ice cream side. So you kind of have this like um, height difference thing. But the ice cream side is really flat. Okay, and you can actually put stuff on top, so like, I guess if you really wanted to, you could put the Jenny's table on top, um, maybe dolls on doll stands on top. I had my two Swarovski dolls, two of my Swarovski dolls, uh, on display on top of this for a little bit in the doll room, because it's a flat space. Uh, you could do a lot with it. You can make a, like, exclusive, like, seating on top. Is that, but you're gonna, you know, you're gonna have to be careful because if you roll this, then stuff's gonna probably fall down. Okay, so now we're gonna be going into the accessories part of this video. Now, if you're watching this and you're like, um, you literally have the ice cream upside down, let me talk about that. So, these are your four big cartons that fit into the circles. So these are a lot bigger than the regular Jenny's ice cream cartons that you get with past Jenny's sets that we talked about. Uh, these are a lot bigger, and I'll show you a side comparison here in a minute. But, so going back to these, you get four of these, you get one brand, no wait, bamble, Bambleberry Chris, one wild berry lavender, one blackout chocolate cake, and one green mint chip. So you get lids for this, okay? But these lids, they don't 
really work kind of with them. Okay, so these are the lids. And they could come off, obviously. If you put the ice cream in the big circles, you can't put the lid on the bottom, even though it works better on the bottom, because they don't really fit and you can't get that uh, window thing to close. So on one side of this, you have the ice cream, and it's very detailed. The texture is amazing. Uh, the bamboo, uh, which one do I have? The bamboo berry crisp is like white with like dark pink and like these caramel stripes it's very very pretty so you have that on one side and then and then you have just like an empty thing on the other where you can put stuff in okay and the lid actually works better on the bottom because if you put the lid on the bottom then you have your label on the carton that's upright and it's not upside down but then if you put the label on the top where the ice cream detail is your label is upside down. So, and you're supposed to put the ice cream in where the ice cream is on top. I, I feel like I'm not doing a good job at explaining this. I'm so sorry. And the circle, then your label is upside down. Inside of the other ice cream um, cartons, we have our light purple one. That's the lavender. We have our blackout chocolate. It's like chocolate with like dark chocolate like sprinkles. And then we have our mint, which is literally looks like mint ice cream. I mean, it's green with like little chocolate. Here's a size comparison between those big four ice cream cartons compared to the regular Jenny's ice cream cartons. You do get regular just Jen Jenny's ice cream cartons in the set, which we'll talk about here in a minute. As you can see, the four giant ones are a lot bigger than the regular ice cream cartons that are in past American Girl Jenny's ice cream sets and with some other cartons that you get in the set. So if you put just the regular ice cream cartons that you get and like the past Jenny's ice cream sets, they're not going to work because they're not as big as the circles. So now we're going to be talking about the regular ice cream cartons. You get four regular ice cream cartons. These are actually different flavors than the four that I talked about previously. So you get one that's dairy three, dairy free Texas street cake, strawberry buttermilk, buttercream birthday cake, and salty caramel. I really like how they included different flavors than those big sized. Now we have like the regular size and like they're different. So these actually have ice creams inside. These don't smell. These are not scented sadly, but the they're still pretty cool. So inside each of these you do have ice cream. So on top they're like really flat. Uh, make it look like that they've been untouched. Okay. And then if you dump it the ice cream out, you have it to where it's scooped so it's scooped ready to go it's like in four ice cream scoops and then you can set it on top in the container and make it look like your ice cream is like scoop scooped and like your doll's eating it out of the carton when it's like scooped and ready to go you know anyways so that's like a really fun detail those that detail is like literally the same as the other ice cream cartons so okay next up you get three ice creams that are supposed to fit in either a waffle cone bowl or just a regular bowl that you get with the ice cream truck so first up you get uh, one that is the bumbleberry crisp and these are like scoops okay in like a bowl if that makes sense so there's like three there are four scoops three in the bottom and then one on top next one is the I think this is like the chocolate blackout um, one. These kind of correspond with those big large containers. And then this last one is the wild berry lavender. Then you get four ice creams that is supposed to fit in a waffle cone. So one of the flavors is Brumbleberry Crisp. Once again, these correspond with those large ice cream containers. We have the, the mint chip. We have the wild berry lavender and then we have that chocolate flavor. Now we're on to like the ice cream like how you serve it to people I guess. <laughs> you get three waffle cone bowls. These are really textured and really neat. Everything, oops I dropped it. It's not a video unless I drop something I feel like anymore. Anyways, I feel like these, I don't feel like these are really textured and you can really feel that texture. Same with all the ice cream that you get in this set. They're really textured and you can feel that. And so I really like that detail that American Girl 
has to offer. And then you have three white bowls. So in case one of your customers not really feeling a waffle cone that day, but they still want like ice cream, serve it into a bowl. Four waffle cones. These are once again textured, really, really fun. These do not, like the waffle cone parts, these do not smell. Nothing in the ice cream truck is scented. You get six different color spoons to serve with your waffle cone bowls or with just your regular white bowls. You have a light green, a light blue, a light purple, a yellow, a light pink, and an orange. Next up you get one ice cream scooper. And then I wasn't sure how many of these it came with because I can't really remember. But I know, like I remember at least opening one. It's this ice cream cone holder that you put your ice cream cone in and then you attach it to your doll's hand. I'm pretty sure it at least came with one, maybe came with two. Um, when I had this, okay, quick story. I didn't, I filmed opening the ice cream truck video and then I didn't finish it like we are right now. So then I just moved it to my doll room. Uh, somewhere in my doll room and I set it up with like every single Jenny's ice cream set that I had and so all the pieces were com combined and so like I had to like pull up the American Girl website and be like okay how many of these ice cream bowls did it actually came with? How many of these did it actually came with? And I couldn't find the number that of the ice cream like doll holders it came with so yeah but I know it at least came with one so there's that representation. And then we have dollar bills. You get one, two, three, four, five dollars of one dollar bills. And they're paper, so be very careful. And then we have, you have one Jenny's card that it comes with. I'm pretty sure this is like a gift card maybe. I mean, I guess you could say it's a credit card, but I'm pretty sure it's a gift card because it says it's orange and it says Jenny's ice cream. The back, it says American Girl with like a card um, thing. And then you get a card reader, which is actually a phone. This is so, like, modern. Oh, my goodness. So you get an iPhone. Well, it's not really an iPhone. It's like a smartphone. And on top you have your card reader, so you can insert your card and, you know, it reads it. <laughs> so this is your phone. You have a light pink, kind of almost purple phone case that you attach. This was kind of hard to get on the phone because you have this extra thing on top. Okay, and then you have these screens. Um, inside one is just a Jenny's pen pad, and I can't even remember what the other one is, but I'm not going to take it out because it was such a struggle to put the phone case on with that extra, like, card reader thing because the card reader is attached and you can't take it off to put the phone, like, case on. Okay, remember how I was talking about those things that have a T on the back of them that you hang up on the cabinets? We're going to be talking about those things now. So you get two of them that can hold... Um, either your waffle cone bowls or just your regular bowls. So one of them is like this clear pink color. The other one is like this like green blue color. I'm not sure what it will show up on camera. Who knows because it's a really pretty color honestly. And then you have one that has a T on the back that is to hold your waffle cones. So this is how you do that. Hold on let me grab a waffle cone real quick. So you put it, hold on, let me grab a stack of them so you guys can see. So you put your waffle cones in a stack on the top of it, so not where this green, not where the gray bar thing is, so you do it on top where like the T on the back is, okay? And then this is how it looks inside, all right? And here's the thing, you can pull the waffle cone out like this, but as you can see it's kind of hard to and I feel like you're going to kind of mess it up from doing that a lot. So what I like to do is I like to just put it on display like this and if I just need one I just grab it from the top. Because that way I'm not risking it get, getting damaged or messed up. Because I feel like it could eventually do that if you do it so many times. You kind of have like wear and tear on those. I don't know. That's just my opinion. And then you have one where it's gray and it's kind of like a cup. That is for your spoons. So your spoons could go in however you want them, your spoons to look. And then the last thing that you get in the ice cream truck is a cardboard box that says Jenny's. Hold on, let me zoom out so then you guys can... Okay, well that didn't really work. <laughs> Anyways, it's orange and it's cardboard and you can fold down the top of it like the um to close it up I didn't do that I just left it how it comes in the packaging so on one side it says ice creams and sides please open immediately with an arrow that says up and then on the other side it says Jenny's and then kind of on the 
kind of box lids. It says Jenny Splendid Ice Creams. Please open immediately this side up. Flavors everything on one of them. Another one just says Grass Glazed Milk. And then it has this like certified B. And then on the bottom is says this box is upside down with ice cream of uh, spilling and yeah really cute little box um you can fold it down and you can like package it if you really wanted to i feel like they included this just in case like maybe your dolls ran out of ice cream for your truck well they got a shipment in new ice cream open up the new shipment or maybe you're shipping ice cream out to customers Alrighty, everyone so that was this week's video i hope you all enjoyed it I really love the ice cream cart. I think it's really cute. I think there's a lot of different ways you can play with it. You can use it. I really think it's a cool piece for American Girl to come out with. Uh, this is the first time they ever came out with an ice cream truck. So pretty cool because in the past they had, you know, Samantha's ice cream parlor. They had the Truly Me ice cream kind of cart thing, but not like an ice cream cart, it was like, not an ice cream truck, it was like an ice cream cart, which I still have to get, that's like one of the pieces on my wish list to get someday. But anyways, I really feel like this is super duper neat and really cool, I love the colors, I think it's really fun, and yeah, I think American Girl did a really good job with this. I hope that they continue the Jenny's collaboration because I feel like this is such a cute and fun collaboration. I felt like it's something different for American Girl. And yeah, I just really been enjoying all of the American Girl Jenny's collection. Make sure if you haven't gone watch my other video I did about the American Girl Jenny's. Be sure to do so. Um, I open everything in the collection except for obviously this piece. And then I also made a video where I went to the American Girl. Let me rephrase that. I also did a video where I went to a Jenny's ice cream shop that was participating in the American Girl collaboration. So yeah, now through I think May 31st, if you visit a Jenny's ice cream shop, now here's the thing. There's only a couple that are participating so you have to make sure that you're visiting participating one to get this deal but if they're participating in the American Girl collaboration they have displays featuring the collaboration so you can actually see American Girl doll in the Jenny's. Uh, they have a offer where you, if you're there for the American Girl special or if you bring in your doll you can get a free ice cream scoop and a doll size cup with a doll size spoon. They also have stickers and exclusive seating. It's really really fun. I went to the one in Nashville and it was really cool. So I'll link that video down below. Thanks for watching this video everyone. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram. It's the same name, Dollies and Rainbows. Check me out on TikTok as well. Really fun stuff happening on there. Same name, Dollies and Rainbows. Be sure to check out my Dom Mom podcast. I just posted a new episode, and this episode is so much fun that I just posted. Oh my goodness, I have on one of the Kansas City American Girl store workers, and we talk about American Girl Kansas City. We talk about the visuals. They worked on the visual team, but like they pretty much did like everything, so we talk about that. So if you ever really wanted to work at American Girl store, listen to this episode because it is for you. It is so much fun, and I had a lot of fun doing it. So I'll link my Dumb Mom podcast down below. Uh, you can listen to it on pretty much anywhere you listen to music and other podcasts. Give this video a like if you enjoyed it. Comment down below what you think of the American Girl Jenny's collaboration. Uh, what you think of the ice cream truck. Do you have this ice cream truck? Do you have any of the pieces from the collaboration? What's your favorite? Uh, what's on your wish list? What do you have in your collection? What pieces do you wish that they come out with? Anything. Get the conversation going down below if you're able to, of course. And yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all I have to tell you. I'll see you next time. Bye!